A Victoria teacher is back at school after an incredible journey. He cycled all the way to the Arctic Ocean, towing his dog Cinder to raise money for Broken Promises Rescue. But what started as a way to give back turned into a truly life-changing expedition. Here's Tess Van Stratton with Vital People. Bonjour les élèves. Bonjour, Ça va bien? Paul Hayes is back in the classroom teaching his French immersion class at École Cedar Hill Middle School. Alors, sont tes... After an epic summer journey. Et les gens... Ton leap. Going up island, it was just amazing. Uh, just people stopping on the road, encouraging us. Okay, here we go, Cinder. Come on. Paul decided to bike all the way to the Arctic with his beloved dog, Cinder, to raise money for Broken Promises Rescue. Everywhere we went, we were greeted just with positive energy, and people were helping us out, uh, always asking us if we needed anything. Just a little warm-up ride, baby. Paul set off in July, towing Cinder behind him and carrying all of their supplies, cycling a staggering 3,385 kilometers to Tuktoyaktuk and the Arctic Ocean. Day by day, uh, you get put into situations that really test you, and just, I think, keeping a positive mindset and just keeping on trying to push forward through what's uncomfortable was probably what I took from this journey. Traveling isolated roads and biking 12 to 14 hours a day, they encountered bears and other wildlife. But the scariest part of the trip was cycling the remote Dempster Highway, a 740 kilometer stretch of gravel road where they encountered an aggressive grizzly bear and her cubs in the open tundra. Going past the, the mother and two cubs, we flied down a motorcyclist and we were able to uh, just go together and I just communicated if, listen, if you need to, for some reason, we have a situation where the bear will charge, you can, you can leave. And <laughs> After 34 grueling days, Paul and Cinder arrived in Tuktoyaktuk where they were greeted by the local community at the Arctic Ocean sign. It's pretty emotional, like absolutely. Um, it's hard to talk about a little bit because just because of how kind so many people were to us. In the end, Paul raised more than $23,000 for Broken Promises, the largest donation the volunteer run rescue has ever received. The courage and commitment that took for him to do that is utterly amazing and I'm forever grateful to him for that and the outpouring of support from the public and all of the donations is going to be huge and help so many animals. For Paul, the life-changing journey has an amazing twist. He found love at the end of it and was offered a job that starts next month. Everything led us to Tuktoyaktuk, and at the end, I met a, a beautiful woman. Looks like we might be going back to the Arctic. But this time, they'll drive. Vital People, brought to you by the Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.